Hey guys, Scooter got a job. Oh my God. I don't know what kind of job Scooter got, but he got him a job today. Oh my goodness. Stephanie got on her page today on, I saw, I was down in the gutter, down in the sewer, whatever, Carolina Cow. Apparently somebody pissed Carolina Cowboy off because he calls the Discord now the, uh, he calls it the sewer or the gutter or the basement or something. I, I don't know. Apparently somebody in there pissed him off, but. I was in the sewer uh, Discord today, uh, the one, the Dirty Discord, and somebody posted a screenshot of Sniffany's, uh, I guess Facebook, Instagram, whatever the hell they're posting on these. I don't know. But she said that damn Scooter done went to work. Scooter was at work, and she was looking after the youngins, and they was just happier than uh, damn pig in shit, or whatever you want to say. God Almighty. I couldn't believe it. I said, damn, Scooter went to work. You know what happened yesterday? I seen a damn picture of Scooter, about three of them. Scooter took a shower. Oh, my God, he took a shower and he washed his damn hair. Man, his hair wasn't greasy. Imagine that. Holy shit. Scooter took a shower and he combed his hair and he put on some normal-looking clothes. He even had a shirt on, man. Scooter had a shirt on. Y'all believe this shit? I don't. Oh, my goodness. I don't believe it at all. I mean, I believe it because I've seen it, but I don't believe it at the same time. I'm like, what the hell? Man, Scooter's turned over a new leaf. He's damn taking showers and wearing clean clothes and combing his hair. My goodness, he even went to work. Man, y'all believe this shit? Wow. I mean, I don't know what the hell kind of job he's doing because he, he supposedly went to work this morning. And then, like, fucking 10, 30, 11 o'clock this morning, he was like, well, guy, somebody posted another screenshot from this time from Scooter's social media page. Whatever the hell he's using now, probably Instagram or one of them, but, uh, and he was like, well, guys, I'm off work for the day, now I'm gonna head to the mall or head to the beach with the youngins, and we're just gonna have fun and relax. I'm like, Scooter, what in the hell, what, what the hell kind of job do you have where you go in at, like, 8 o'clock in the morning and get off at 10.30, dude? That's like three hours, man, that, that ain't, you know, what kind, what kind of job, I'm like, damn, what kind of job do you do with that? I'm like... I'm like, man, even a job at Walmart, man, fucking working part-time, you still going to work at least five, six hours. You know, that ain't even worth the trip down there. That ain't even worth the car ride over there to, to only work three, four hours. But, you know, then I start thinking, I said, well, I said, you know, this is Scooter we're talking about here. And, um, you know, I mean, hey, this is the same guy that once considered helping his mama around the house is, is being a job, is having a job. I mean, you know. Like, you know, that is a job, I guess, if you're, like, 13 years old and you're just trying to earn some money to spend at the skating rink or at the bowling alley on Friday night, you know, earn you a little 20 or $30 to, for spending money, you know, on Friday night. But when you're 35 years old, you know, that, that, that ain't a job. I mean, and I started thinking, I, I was thinking, what the hell kind of job could he have? We're only working, like, three hours. I said, you know what? I bet you almost any damn thing. Oh, uh, Sinead's family done put his ass to work. They, done, they they did. I bet they did. I don't know for sure, but somebody down there, somebody, because he's in the shittiest Virginia, and we, not, we all know how that goes when Scooter's in the shittiest Virginia. They get him down there so they can use him, man. They do. My God, they get him down there so they can use him. And they it's probably Sinead's family or a neighbor or somebody she knows probably done got him down there and used him to do some work for a couple damned hours. They probably paid him a little money, but... I mean, he probably wasn't like 50 bucks or 100 bucks, whatever. Scooter deserves thousands of damn dollars for his time. His, Scooter's time's valuable. He's a valuable fucking member of the damn community. He's a famous live streamer, for God's sake. Shit. He's going to be a future rock star. God damn, he's got an album coming out. On, he's coming real soon. We heard about that a while back. He said, keep your ears to the streets and watch out for iTunes and 103 out of Beckley. Damn, that dude's probably awesome, bright as fuck. But Scooter's got an album coming out, damn it. He's got a new movie that he's filming. And he's a podcaster, too. He's got a podcast that's coming any damn day now. He's done recorded a bunch of them. And he's just waiting to upload it because he's not real sure what to title it yet, what the name of it's going to be. But it's all coming. And they want to pay this man probably $50 or 100 bucks to do a couple hours worth of fucking work, man. That's bullshit. Scooter, you need to... I'm telling you, man, this girl's done it to you again, man. They got you down there so they could use you, man. You put in hot water heaters. You name it. You did all that shit. And what do they do? Get you back down there again and use you, man. My God. I 
was sitting there thinking about that, and that just made me so mad. And the only thing, I, the first thing that came to mind was, oh, my God. Well, I hate her guts, man. I hate her guts. I hate her guts. Now, I'm not going to I'm not going to say the other part of that that Scooter originally said. I don't, I don't really hate anybody. You know, but, you know, but, but damn, though. Yeah, I ain't gonna say the racial part of that shit. It's good to say it after he said that. But, you know, like, you know, that's bullshit, though, man. She got you down there so you, they could use you again, Scooter. They got you down there to use you. They're taking advantage of you, Scooter. They know that you're from the best Virginia, and they know that they're in the shittiest Virginia. And they know that you're, you're one of the best people because you're from the best state in the best Virginia. And they know that you've got all these fucking mad skills and you know how to do all kind of shit. And they're trying to use you. They're taking advantage of you, Scooter. You can't let them do it. You can't let that girl do you like that, Scooter. Don't let her do it. I'm telling you. It's bullshit. Don't let her do it. You need to get back to the best Virginia. To the real meth camper, not meth camper East or Sniffler's Cove, whatever they, whatever they're calling these days. Casa de car, whatever they're called. I, I don't know. That, that was kind of mean. I don't know. But, uh, the skank attack, whatever. That's kind of mean, too. Y'all, y'all be saying to yourselves. Then again, I don't, then again, I, I kind of understand. Because she got him down there so she could use him and put his ass to work. She just wanted to put you to work, Scooter. Your mama didn't make you get a job. Your girlfriend did, though, apparently. My goodness. I'm disappointed in you, Scooter. You're letting that girl use you. And I know you are, and you know I, you know I'm right, and I know I'm right. That's bullshit. Made me so mad. I mean, for real. I'm being for real. That's the first thing that came to my mind. Was I hate her guts, man? I hate her guts. I mean, I don't hate her, but I don't like what she's doing to you, Scooter. I don't know. I mean, I like that. It's good that you took a shower and you combed your hair and you put on some clean clothes. That's probably not a bad thing. You know, that's probably all right right there, but. I don't know, though. I don't know how I feel about any of this. It's, everything's just changing so quickly. I, I don't know. I, I don't really like change all, all the time there, Scooter. And everything's changing. You're not going live very much anymore. My goodness. Scooter, you need, you, you need to come online and put together an epic live feed. Maybe get your buddy uh, Junior Samples on there. Get him to go on the live feed with you. And y'all, because you and Junior can put together a, an amazing amazing live feed together i bet you and junior samples i bet you could because he was uh he's famous too i think he was on that he haul show back in the day i believe if i'm not if i'm not mistaken junior samples was a famous guy on that old he haul show he's come on back in the damn 70s or the 80s or some shit but i don't know but seriously go you need to get on there get on the live feed and tell us how and tell us all or remind us all how great you are Cause we ain't heard it in a while, and everybody's just dying to know how the hell things have been going for you. And we all want to hear about your new job, Scooter. I mean, if you got a real job, but I suspect you're probably getting taken advantage of by that damn girlfriend of yours. She's up to her old tricks again, Scooter. She's trying to use you, man. And you need to tell that damn girl that you're not going to allow her to use you because you're not going to sit there and put in hot water tanks and you name it and this and that and all that other stuff. You're not going to let her do that to you. I bet she didn't even pay you in full for the hot water heater that you installed. God, they probably didn't even pay you in full for your time today. It's bullshit. Am I right, though, Scooter? Is that what your job is? Are you just helping out the neighbor? Or are you, you know, one of her friends? Or are you just helping out one of her family members? I bet you are. Because a normal job, you don't go in at like, you know, 7, 8 o'clock in the morning and then get off at 10.30, though. That I don't, you know, don't kind of work that way. But Yeah, I don't know, you know. Who knows? Who knows? Maybe Scooter only worked like three hours today because it was his first day on the job. I don't know. I would imagine, though, if I had to guess, he, it's probably what I was thinking earlier, my first thought. That he's probably was just helping somebody clean up the yard or some shit like that or unloading some boxes out of somebody's car for him or their truck or something, you know, doing some work for Grandma or whatever. I, I don't know. Damn it, Scooter, you can't let her use you like that any damn more. You need to put your foot down, Scooter, and tell her that, no, you're not going to do this, and that you and her are going back to the meth camper. By God, the real meth camper, not not that fake meth camper East bullshit y'all are living at now in the shittiest Virginia. And get back to the best Virginia. Because, by God, you're the best Scooter. 
and you deserve to live in the best Virginia. Damn it. She's trying to change you, Scooter, and I ain't gonna let it happen. Not on my watch there, Missy. You ain't trying to change my man, Scooter, like that. I'm his biggest damn fan, and I ain't gonna have it. You ain't gonna do him like that. No damn more. You ain't gonna use him that way. Shanae. Fuck, man. It's bullshit how they do you, Scooter. It's wrong. I don't like it. And you gotta put a stop to it, man. Don't let her use you, man. Damn, Scooter, I'm disappointed in you. My goodness. But I am glad to see you got you, you got you some work or something. Maybe you earned a few dollars. I don't know. But the best part of that is, the good part is you took a shower and you combed your hair and put on clean clothes, Scooter. Congratulations. I am happy to hear about that. And, y'all, that's all I got for today. That is the going zone in the Scooterverse currently. As far as I know, I don't know. I, I'm not really in the loop anymore. But, uh, you know, what little bit I am, that, that that's... That is today's events and goings on in the Scooterverse. Oh, y'all have a good night, folks. And damn it, Scooter, quit letting her take advantage of you like that. Bullshit, man. Bullshit. And you know I'm right, Scooter. You know. Bye, folks.